Hey everyone, it's Max here, and I'm back with, um, what is this, I'm doing Christmas raiding, yeah, I'm, I guess I'm doing Christmas raiding, and attack strategy, I guess, and as you can see, um, I got quite a few, I got three trees actually, which I'm pretty happy about, and I accidentally collected a few presents on this tree, eh, but that's okay. Nobody will know. And now these are some raids I did yesterday. It's this is gonna be like a attack strategy video. I was using the giant arch goblin healer wizard. Anyways, this is a really good dark elixir farming strategy. Although I didn't go for dark elixir in these. It's really good at getting through the base, like to the middle, because when you have level six giants, it's pretty good. And if you have level seven and you're at town hall ten, it might it's probably even better. So, yeah. Now this raid I did on Christmas Eve. So, yeah, I'd like to say Merry Christmas to y'all that celebrate it. So, yeah, I'm gonna place a heal spell down on the giants. Bring mostly heal spells with you. Sometimes like one or two rage. But not too many rage. So yeah. Um, I hope you all are having a nice Christmas. And see I'm gonna use a rage close to the middle. Yeah, usually you want to get the rage close to the middle like when you have dark elixir storages. Because then... They just destroy their storage really fast, so then you can get everything. Now this one is a pretty good raid because I actually got 100% on it. And yeah, I got all the loot instead of um, instead of going for Dark Elixir. So, uh, I don't really know what to call the strategy. But the pros and cons of the strategy, the giants and everything else i'll just call it the the giant uh, i don't know what to call it giant healer wizard strategy or town hall 9 giant rush i guess uh, the pros and cons it's like it's quite cheap quite fast to train i mean well like you can take out a few of the wizards, but that just, it weakens the strategy a little bit. So, you might not want to do that. So, there's another raid. It's against a town of white. Use this against, like, other town hall nines. Not, like, max town hall nines. You don't want to do that. That's a little bit too hard. Unless you have, unless you're, like, amazing at attacking. Or you're already town hall 10. Like, with level 7 giants then attack max town all nines so i would say this is actually like a farming strategy wouldn't really call it a trophy push because the giants do not be kind of unpredictable so once you get to like crystal 2 crystal 1 there you might not be getting consistent two stars or even one stars you might even fail a few attacks i'll if you can find Town Hall 8s with a good amount of Dark Elixir or regular loot, this is a really good strategy because if you have high enough healers, at least heroes, not healers, um, it'll be really easy. Like, if you have like level 5 heroes at least, that's good enough probably. You just need the ability. And I got level 10 and level 7, which isn't too bad. And as you can see, I am going to put a heal spell here. I'm trying to make life a little easier. And I'll speed this up. Uh, the cons of the strategy is that well-placed um, spring traps, yeah, they will kill your giants. And also, it's kind of hard to like use against some bases because... You might need some time, like some are like anti-giant 
basis, which isn't good, so. Yeah, now we could just speed this up. They're just gonna run to this last builder hut. Yeah, get all that money. So that's that's good, good stuff. And now we have a Balloonian raid for Dark Elixir. Uh, well, I guess this isn't really part of the attack strategy, but I can talk about Balloonian. I may, I'll do it in a different video. But pretty much, you just it's pretty straightforward. Put balloons in the front, followed up by minions. You don't have to worry about the clan castle. You might want to bring a lightning spell. But there's you don't have to take out the clan castle. And I accidentally threw down my clan cast my clan castle here. And I recommend mostly rage, sometimes heal if you like. Depends on the base kind of. I just bring two rage to to heal for regular raids. But if you're doing a war raid, make sure to like Scout the basin, see what you think needs. And now I'm actually my heroes are actually gonna f clear up all the dark elixir here. Pretty good. So I did get a lot of elixir too. So to get the town hall easy two star. Use use balloonian. Um, it's it's a really good strategy. Use it on like, you can use it on any base. Recommended that the expos are set to ground. So don't go around attacking like level 3 expos that are set to air. And like, if you can find air defense kind of spread out, not like all the way in the middle, then that would be good. Because you want to try to take out the air defense. You want to just like rush one side. And yeah, so is my, are my troops ready? Oh dang, they're not. Uh, okay, I'll just I'm gonna do one raid because I don't want to boost my barracks and play for two hours straight. <laughs> so yeah, let's see if there's any good bases that can revenge her. Well, this is. Dang, he's got a clan castle. I'm gonna see if I can revenge this dude. But I'll probably have to wait until my... Nope, his villages. Got a shield. So I'm just gonna wait 30 seconds. I'll speed this up. Alright. 30 seconds are done. And my army is full. I'm just gonna train up more giants. Because that's what I'm just gonna raid with next time. It's just, the strategy is just awesome. It really is. Yeah, let's break the shield. I didn't force some Dark Elixir. Because I want to get Golems level 2 or Witches level 2. Mm -hmm. So I'm looking for at least 1500. But if there's a really easy one with like 1200, I might take that too. So. I'll, if I can't find a base, I'll just, I'll just skip. And I'll be back when I find a base. Uh. Okay. Alright, so. Here I found a base that I think is good. He's got Expo Building. Only one expo available. Low level heroes. Let's start by sniping it. Let's see, um, there's. I don't think there's a need to lure out the clan castle. So I'm just gonna send in a few giants. Take out these outer buildings. More. Nope, not wall breakers. I didn't mean to do that. Let's go wizards. Let's heal these guys up. Let's go heroes. Then a few goblins. Final wall breaker. 
Healer. Oh god, watch out for the jam bomb. No. No. Okay, that's not bad. Easily taking out that dark elixir storage. See if I can get other loots like right here. I might even need to use a rage spell right now. Oh, that guy's doing good damage on the gold storage. And now my queen's taking out everything. She good. Come on. Oh, why aren't you going for the other loot? That's okay. I got all their dark elixir. That's all that matters. And we're gonna end this battle with a lot of loot. So that's a pretty good raid for Christmas raiding. Uh, anyways, thanks for watching, y'all. Oh, I even tramped my troops. Oh my god. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, Merry Christmas to everyone and Happy Holidays. And I'll see you guys in another video, I guess. I guess this is the end. So yeah. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for another video. Bye.